Hello everyone, Shannon DeNovo here. Uh, this video is going to go over how to lock your meeting room uh, when you're having a meeting with students. So we're going to start with signing in. And in order to sign in, we got to make sure we're at the right place. So let's get to everybody, guhsdaz.webex.com. Okay, so this is the web browser and everybody regardless of your device, can go ahead and log in and edit their settings here. Okay, so you're going to click on the sign in, and it signed me in automatically, but make sure you sign in with your GUHSD email. Okay, this takes you to your home screen. So from the home screen, you're going to go down into the preference settings. Once in preferences, we're going to edit our preferences for our personal room. So scoot over here to my personal room. Click there, and then you're going to scroll down. You're going to go ahead and lock your room for zero minutes after the meeting starts. So people can't enter until you see their name and click allow to go ahead and let them into the meeting. When you're done with that, go ahead and scroll down and click save. You'll see that this toolbar pops up saying that your changes have been saved and now your meeting will be locked and you'll have to let your students in one by one. It's a good idea to let the students know that you're going to be letting them in if you've been doing it the traditional way where they can just come in um, without the allowance. So they know that they're going to be waiting for you to allow them in. And that is how to lock your personal room. Thank you very much.